Hey guys, Nox is here and in this video I'm going to show you how to play Joyful Beasts and their auspices. So there are three game modes and we have here our gameplay details. So we have here our general rule. You can use bumper wushu mode and knock aside other participants. But if you come in contact with other bumper, uh, bumper wushu mode, then both modes will be deactivated. And we have three stages for players to choose from. And also we have two gameplay modes. You can you can invite multiple teammates or you can play with other players. So we have here our game modes. First we have good things come rolling in. So here we're going to collect lucky tea bricks. And the more tea bricks we collect, the higher the points we get. And we can use our bumper will show to knock other participants away. And you can also obtain any luck tea bricks drop by other participants and then we have here our race to the top so here we're going to race with other with other players while collecting valor points and you can gain valor points by gaining fortune t bricks and staying on the platform and you can use your bumper will shoot to knock away other participants okay so t bricks will appear on the field at inter intervals and we're going to uh, we're going to pick this one to get Valor points Okay, parts of the field will rise at intervals to turn into Elevated platforms, so we need to stay on these platforms to continuously gain Valor Okay, so avoid the The red hazardous areas And then we have the to pluck good fortune So here we start with mildness and we lose mildness as time pa passes by and then okay so we can avoid uh, losing mildness by entering safe zones and we can also increase our mildness by collecting prosperous tea bricks and then also we need to avoid a super spicy walk hay by entering the safe zone okay so we're going to try all three uh, modes here and let's start with this one So we need to collect many lucky tea bricks here to score points. Okay, go for the big ones. And avoid the bumper modes of the other players. Okay. Okay, you can use your bumper mode to uh, to hit other players, and you gain some bricks. Okay, always go for the big ones guys. They give more points. Okay, 
Okay, so we won the challenge. So you can time your bumper mode guys to hit other characters or other players. Like what the other players are doing earlier. So you can time it to hit other characters or players. Okay, so let's try the other modes. So let's try race to the top. Okay, so we need to collect fortune tea bricks and stay on the platform. Okay, just stay on the platform guys. Avoid the red ones. Okay, time your bumper to hit other other players. You can choose not to stay on the platform if other characters are threatening your character. Especially if your bumper is on cooldown. So you can choose to stay outside the platform. Okay, so we we won again a challenge. And then let's try the last mode. Okay, so we have this last mode. Okay, so in this mode, we're going to have um, mildness at the start. And we'll be affected by super spicy spirit. So our mild mildness will, um, will go down as time passes by. And then... And then Okay, so we need to enter safe zones to avoid the effects of super spicy spirit. And we can also collect tea bricks to increase our mildness. Okay, and we need to avoid super spicy walk hay.
Okay, I, I suggest that you don't use your bumper yet. Just use it when the safe zones appear. Okay, enter the safe zone. Okay, we might we might not win this one. Okay, so we're only second. I think. A pot of tea with a couple of nibbles, some seasonal greens, and a piping hot bowl of fresh kanji. Okay, so let's check our rewards. So we have a limit of 2,000 square per day guys and the limit will increase af after one day. Okay, so we have here our rewards. And I think once the event is done, we can select one character here to join our, our party. So that's it guys, that's how you, that's how you play. Uh, I forgot the name. Joyful Beast and their auspices. Thank you for watching.